It's earned the nickname zombie deer disease, and experts say it just keeps spreading. Its real name is chronic wasting disease, and the big fear is that it could one day actually spread into the human population. Our Steve Garajola shows us why this is a very real issue, and it's right here in Michigan. It's unofficially called zombie deer disease, but this is no invention of Hollywood, and it's certainly no joke. Hollywood has brought zombies to a new level of popularity, but there's nothing entertaining about a disease in Michigan's deer population called chronic wasting disease. And it especially targets um, cells that are in neural tissue and in the brain, and it causes these um, holes to form in the brain and eventually that's going to be fatal. The disease has spread to 24 states, including Michigan. The target zone in Michigan is 16 counties in the center and west side of the state. 60 cases have been confirmed. No cases have been reported of the disease transmitting to humans, but many experts believe it's just a matter of time, comparing this disease to the mad cow outbreak of the late 1980s in Britain. It's certainly something to be concerned about, and, and the reason for that is that there are closely related diseases that are already in humans. To help combat the spread of the disease, baiting or feeding of deer is no longer allowed across all of Michigan's lower peninsula. The Centers for Disease Control recommend that hunters test deer before eating meat in affected areas. If a deer looks sick or acts strangely, hunters should not shoot, handle it, or eat its meat. I'm Steve Garagiola, Local 4.